another challenge video which actually started to be a big challenge because I think this is already my sixth or seventh attempt to tape a video because I think the other ones are like uh, way too much noises around areas uh, people having a conversation which is normally of course but also cars passing with uh, uh, loud uh, uh, noises or a scooter passing so I thought like maybe you don't hear me so that's not so good because the point of the challenge is of course to uh, see or hear me in this case both one in a row so the, uh, it's actually pretty challenge and see if this one works out uh, it's another lovely day here in Geneva in total I will stay in Geneva for three and a half weeks well I'm already heading to the end of my stay here I do a house sitting assignment here I'm taking care of a cat she's 13 years old and I, uh, take out the uh, post the mail out of the mailbox and uh, take care of the plants there are not many plants so there's a very easy job and today I went to Carouche this morning to buy some cat food because the cat is 13 she needs special food and I ran out of it so I walked here uh, Carouche is, uh, used to be a, a town on its own and now it's an area of Geneva Carouche is built like uh, under the wings of a royal family, Italian family. So the houses here are different, the building style is different, but they use much more colors than they use in Geneva. Uh, so it's actually a very nice area. So if you uh, happen to come to Geneva, you should definitely check out this place. The uh, streets are a little bit smaller. Actually, the shops are small too. That's so surprising to me. There are so many tiny shops here that are probably uh, more uh, small than your own living room. And they all have their special uh, selling. So one only sells cheese, another one only sells chocolate, another one only sells sausages. And they still can survive because they have, uh, the people here in Switzerland are probably very loyal to where they buy their stuff. Because uh, in the Netherlands you see and hear that uh, the small specialty shops have a really uh, hard time to uh, stay in business because a lot of people uh, sell uh, buying online or uh, going to the supermarket but here still there are uh, so many nice shops so that's actually very nice to check out I have in the background a very nice street with the colorful umbrellas you see them I see them in Instagram all over the world uh, but it's very nice I love colors so uh, that's a very good one and uh, at the back of this street there's a market going on so that's also why I walked here so I can check out the market uh, it's always nice to go on a market it's sort of a uh, routine when I go somewhere check out uh, some stuff on the market it's always nice to see what the people eat uh, what specialties they have uh, I went to Caruso for the uh, pet, uh, for the cat food. Uh, I walked here because I like uh, being outside and I like to walk. I have a public transportation card for a whole month. I bought it specially for uh, the time I was here. So I think like it's easy to get around uh, by tram or bus. But uh, I could have done a little... Uh, bit use the public transportation but I choose to walk and now we're gonna walk to the market and see what's out there well I choose to stay here because go walking up there uh, there's much more noise of course because there are many people I like people I like the noise I I, uh, I also like to talk so I enjoy hearing other people talking but I'm afraid you will not understand me anymore I will let you into a little secret I already had today because I went to the supermarket and I thought like oh maybe it's nice to uh, buy sort of schnitzel uh, meat and then uh, prepare it with some uh, mushrooms I love mushrooms and then I can cook myself but as the uh, butcher gave it to me I looked at the price and it was like a little bit more than 12 uh, switch francs would, would be like 11 euros for only the meat I didn't even have vegetables or anything on it so I walked in the store and like 
oh my god that's a lot of money and I uh, walk around and you can have a, a, a menu on the day for like 16, 18, 20 and this is like I already pay almost 13 for only meat so I sneak back to the uh, butcher uh, register he, he, he walks in and out of there because he has like two or three different chores there and I put it back on a tray because I didn't want to leave it somewhere else in the store I think like that's really nasty and now I put it back because I thought like I don't want to do that that's a lot of money for uh, doing the cooking myself so that's my little secret of today. Do you have a secret too for me? Tell me, let me in, put it on video. It's not that special secret, but you now know how, how sometimes my head works and my mind works. You probably do some stuff too. See you next time.